Hello guys, welcome back to Coding Cafe. My name is Mohamed Ali and we are going to work on the settings uh, in this video tutorial. Okay, on the account settings so that we can finally allow the user to set the profile image, uh, username and address. So in this video tutorial we will be working on that and also maybe in the next video tutorial too. And then once we uh, complete the settings then after uh, that we will uh, work on this cart functionality or you can say this cart feature and will allow the user to add products uh, to the cart and later on we will allow them to purchase those products so yeah uh, first of all let's come here click here then simply click new and we need uh, another activity which will be empty activity and the name of this activity will be settings activity and then click finish so you can see that uh, the empty uh, the settings activity is created successfully and now go to the activity settings settings.xml file and let's design this so we will change this to relative layout and here we need to add a app bar layout match parent height must be 50 dp and inside we will add a toolbar match parent wrap content so first of all let's add a background uh, for our this app bar layout which will be color primary dark and let me check it so color primary will be the right one okay you can see this and also we need to uh, give it id to our this app bar layout so we can say app bar settings and for the toolbar we can say id let's say toolbar underscore settings and in here i mean inside this toolbar we need to add two buttons or a text view will be good okay so we can set text view which will be for the close and update so we can say text view match parent Rep content the height must be also rep content and the text for this will be close text color must be white at the right and right white and the text size 16 sp let's see what we got here you can see this and uh, let's say textile should also be bold change this text size to 20 so that this button must be visible but not that much okay so 17 and uh, we must align it to the start so we can say first we need to cut this okay control x cut this from here and first let's add a relative layout here so match parent rep content okay it must also be match parent and here we need to paste our text view and after that here we can say now align parent start and it must be true and now let's copy paste this and add another button which will be uh, for updating the settings so it must be align parent end parent end to true if i show you then this is here okay and it must be update 
from the margin from the uh, right side must it must be at will be good at bp let's change this to 10 now let's assign some ids to it so for this we can say uh, close underscore settings and this is a text view bus uh, we will be using as a button i mean so you can give any id to it but you must remember that id later on for the use and uh, for the update we can simply say update account settings so yeah this is our toolbar now we need to after this uh, app bar layout once it's finished and here we need a circle image view so we can say this one okay and match parent rep content but since we want to display i mean not uh, a big image so we can give it 130 dp and height 130 dp the id for this will be settings for file image and the source for this will be profile must be below the uh, app bar okay which is over this one app bar settings so copy this id and uh, paste that here let's give it some margin from the top 20 dp and uh, we move it to the center now we need a uh, text edit text but first we need to add a uh, text view i mean for changing the profile image so let's copy paste this text view and we can paste that here and we can first change it to profile change profile image underscore image change let's say btn and it will be change profile change this uh, align parent to center horizontal and it must uh, below the uh, profile image we can say below id and copy this settings profile image id and paste that here and make sure to remove this text color okay which was white let's give some margin now from the top and it will be 4 will be good and if you want uh, then you can also uh, change the text color for it to black so that it must be visible little bit last thing which is left is to add edit text quickly okay so let's say edit text match parent rep content let's give id to it and we can give it id as settings phone number and it must below the change for file text let's assign some hint it will be phone number and margin from all the sides must be 15 dp and now let's copy paste this so the first one uh, was for the uh, phone number now this one will be for the full name that is the person who is going to purchase something and also change this phone number to full name and it must be below the phone numbers copy this and paste that here you can see this full name and now this one also change this to settings phone settings address on which address we will send the product to the user who will purchase okay and it must be uh, below the full name you can see this 
let's change the hint to address so yeah that's it now if you want you can also add padding to it it's 10 dp and also let's copy paste this and paste that here and also here so yeah now the next thing which is left is to go to the home activity and here we need to come down here here you can see we have this own navigation item selected here when a user click on this settings button we need to send the user to the settings activity so we can say int intent equals to new intent we are on the main acti home activity we want to send the user to the settings activity start activity for the intent now let's run the app to see what happens so the app is running now successfully and now let's log in So we are logged in successfully and now if I go to the settings and here you can see this close update change profile and yeah it is perfect I mean this is amazing so in the next video tutorial we will uh, be working on the settings I mean we just designed the uh, settings activity in this video tutorial and in the next video we will allow the user to set the profile information and also we will allow the user to update his account settings from the settings activity so yeah that's it for this video and see you guys in the next video bye for now